So around the start of COVID-19, uh, when it started to affect our industry in mid to late March, we maintained high hopes of continuing to help people find an apartment home while keeping social distancing at the top of our minds. Um, because in our industry, a lot of the rapport building happens with that first in-person meeting, the tour. Um, it's a critical opportunity for us to get to know our prospective residents, their apartment needs, um, how their search is going, and it's also a good opportunity for them to get to know us. Um, so when the um, COVID pandemic kind of started to affect our industry, we needed to figure out a way that we could still provide as much of that genuine in-person connection, that feeling as we could, um, while keeping a responsible uh, distance. So virtual leasing was installed to help us with that regard and so that we could also kind of remain competitive in the market, you know, because tours don't stop, the industry doesn't stop. So we had to figure out a way to kind of keep going as we adapted to the new normal. So the apps that we primarily use here at Cityville, we use a lot of um, Facebook Messenger. We had a video function there. Um, we also use Skype and FaceTime. Um, some people just didn't like to use Facebook, which was fine. So we had to provide some flexibility there to be able to adapt to, you know, their comfort level, their preferences. Um, so we kind of had to, in, in conjunction with that we had to kind of revamp our communications process leading up to the tour as well so we had to um create new email templates that we would send out ahead of tours, like our tour reminder emails that would include the instructions on how to get all set up for the virtual tour. So we had to kind of completely reorganize and create a new kind of separate email. We saw so much success with the, um, you know, just the convenience factor of it, that it is a tool that we want to keep around, um, particularly with those, like I mentioned before, those who are coming from out of town or out of state um, who wouldn't have that opportunity to see our apartments in person. So we were um, very optimistic in the future uses of this tool um, in that regard, um, because it just, we're still able to, you know, build that connection, build that rapport. Um, the only difference is that we're doing it through screens rather than face-to-face. -face, so.